Hello, people! Welcome, viewers of all ages and all groups and places and things. We are going to be playing Analog, a hate story. Now, this is, um, I think it's more of a interactive novel, if I were to say so myself. But, um, yeah, it's an indie game. Although I think it's more of a novel, but whatever. And there's going to be a lot of reading in this, so what you can do is you can get, take yourself, I mean, nah, get yourself a chair, sit down, get yourself a nice warm cup of coffee, and let us explore this new story, Analog, a hate story. Alright, let us start this new adventure. The system is property of the United Unified Korea Air Space Probe Agency. Access by individuals not afflicted with the UK SPA or a successor organization is a felony under the UK SPA Act of 2381. Okay. <laughs> well, I'm not going to be committing any felonies. <laughs> Just gonna be uh, hacking into this little thing here. Let's see. Let's see our commands. Let's go ahead and type in help. Uh, Alright, looks like those are our commands. Let's see. Um, let's see what SU does. Oh, great, I don't have administrator access. I don't know the password. Alright, let's go to um, enable AI. Enable AI personality. Use to select a new AI personality. Any active personality must be disabled first. Currently available personalities. A unit. Uh, looks like we only have one to do with, so let's go ahead. Enable AI. And then. Oh. A unit. Good. Good. Now. Um, okay, I guess we get to quit then. Quit and enter. Oh my. Hello. Yes, hello. Hello, hello. Oh my word, an external connection. Is someone out there? It's been so many years since I've spoken to anyone. Oh my. Oh jeez, I'm being discourteous. My apologies. Please allow me to introduce myself. My name is Hyune. The star is, of course, silent. It just represents that I'm an AI, so artificial intelligence. I'm guessing. I control all the logs keeping systems on the Magon Way, or at least what's left of them. Please just excuse me for one second. I'll give you a terminal, terminal so I, you can respond. Okay. There you are, holy cow, that was fast. Go ahead and introduce yourself. Alright, uh, hello. My name is... The Noob. Oh dear. Well, what happened? Uh, sure, um, hello. My name is... The Ah, oh, jeez. My apologies. I don't know why, but what you just typed looks like garbage to me. Call my name stupid? Call my name stupid? That is... that is hurtful, ma'am. That is hurtful. That is hurtful. Okay, I'm hurtful. Yeah. That's bad. I think there may be a problem with my language parsing systems. Okay, well, yeah. The ship's kind of destroyed. Uh, you think? Uh, sorry. Somehow your input is getting mangled, ter mangled between the terminal and me. I'm so terribly sorry. Ah, uh, no problem. Let me just try something. Can you understand this? All right. Can you just? 
just click again to confirm that you can understand what I'm saying to you. Very well. We have that. At least I'm afraid if we can't get text input fixed, we'll have... That'll have to suffice. I'm terribly sorry. It must be difficult being unable to say anything. It's a little bit frustrating. I'd love to say... Many things. Okay, many things. Yes, yes. This might be difficult, then. Well, nevertheless, as the archive system, AI, I'll do my best to try to help you navigate these records in. Aw, that's nice. Unfortunately, it might be a little difficult since, well, without language parsing, you won't be able to do text searches either. Oh, uh, that's just great. Great. Don't worry, though. It's my duty to provide assistance with archive functions. I'll do my best. Oh, so, so cute. Alright. Right, let me see. I'll try to provide you with a sampling of logs to start out with. And you can just show me the things that you want more information on. Sounds good. I uh, hope that that'll be acceptable to you. That's all I can do. I know, perhaps. It's fine. Well, that's all, I suppose. Pardon me. Let me just build you an interface to work with so you don't have to struggle with the terminal. Oh, thanks. It should get much easier. Very well, it's all said. Wow, you work fast. Holy cow. And, um, I suppose it's a little bit awkward, but, uh, can I just say one more thing before you just show? Oh, sure, you can ask me anything. I'm just very happy to be working with you. I've had nobody to talk to in such a long time. I got so lonely. Lonely. Um, okay. <laughs> I don't see how an AI can be lonely, but then again, it's artificial intelligence. But Having someone to talk to is really, really amazing. I thought maybe I would never, I would never would again. Sorry about the communication, about the communication barrier. But even still, ah, uh, geez, I'm babbling. I won't hold you up any longer. Here's your interface. I hope it's good enough. This is pretty nice for like seconds of time to put this all together it's pretty nice but uh, you know. um so basically what this is is a game that you go ahead and read all these log documents and then of course then she'll give you some more log documents to look over and of course then you get the overall story by reading different sections of different time frames throughout the span of the Mugungway which is a spaceship which has been destroyed everyone's dead on board but everyone except for the AI, of course. Um, so, then you get to read how they died, what happened on the Montgomery Way, and all this stuff by the access of all these log documents. So, yeah, basically this is more of a reading game. We're reading and a puzzle game. It's an indie game in general, but uh, that's basically the bare bones of the, the whole game. So. Let's go ahead and start accessing all these log documents. There we go. Alright, let's go to block four. And a pack of idiots. I love the music scheme of this. It's so atmospheric. A pack of idiots by Smith Kung Kyung Sam. When our family falls into decline, I just wanted to be perfectly clear why. It's because Daikman's sons are the biggest collection of idiots on the entire ship. This music might be a little bit... Uh... Perfect. Now you can kind of hear my voice a little bit better. Now, Father says these sorts of words shouldn't be written down, calling them unfilo... Filial. But I'm skeptical. Skeptical. Ah, oh, man. I intend to no disrespect to my noble ancestors, but my dead uncle is no ancestor of mine, and his family deserves no respect. This has been in motion for years now. It was an inevitability, even that any sons of Dai Hun, Heyun, would turn out the way they did. But up until now, to anyone outside of the family, it's been well hidden. Only now is it starting to fall apart in a way